nervous about today's screening? Actually, yes, so this is the first, uh, uh, <laughs> little bit nervous, sort of, oh, uh, I don't know. Let's see how the audience turns out, so. I hope this time this is going to be good as well and there's a big audience coming out tonight and we'll see, it's, it's, it's going to be good. Zara? I'm sorry, where was I? Teddy. A short film written and directed by Akash Sunet Kumar, starring Yureni Noshika, is a psychological drama. The story is about a woman who dissects and explores different levels of her marriage. Akash, along with Kasun Ratnasiri, the film's director of photography, started making movies in 2015. Within seven years, they have made short films ranging from a variety of genres like action, horror, thriller and even sci-fi. Their first and second publicly released short films were screened in arguably the biggest entertainment convention in the world, the San Diego Comic Con twice, a first for Sri Lanka. Making a film is actually like training for the Olympics. You have the pre-production phase where you train, you build up your story, pretty much develop everything. And then production is kind of like, you know, the moment you're running the race, that lasts for, for a considerably short time. And then the aftermath of it is where you actually end up putting everything together, what you edited. So that process to get to a place where you are happy with the production, where you are telling the story in the best way that you can, editing it, getting feedback, and then going back up again and cutting it, ensuring that we are telling the story as best as we can, that process takes time. Akash and Kasun, along with their team, worked on the movie for more than 11 months. The filmmakers have been uh, in a comfortable comfort zone. So they know, like we we all know that we uh, we had like phases, like historic films, family films, comedy. So they they were in phases. Like if one does it, the other one does the same thing, cause it's safe. They are all in the comfort zone. So trying to create something new, we can't be in the comfort zone. Like Akash and Kasun, there are many up and coming filmmakers in Sri Lanka. It's obvious that this generation of filmmakers is vastly different from the previous generations. But has the Sri Lankan audience, the biggest stakeholder in this industry, changed? You can't fool the audience is what I think because uh, the newer generation, we have been exposed to all kinds of content through the internet. So they know what's good, what the, the, what the international standard is. So the audience in that way, they have changed. But what I think has not changed is the type of films that we see come out, coming out from the local community. And that, in a way, is what we have to change because it's not, not really a competition amongst filmmakers in the country. It's about us and how far the, the rest of the world is moving ahead. So we need to step our own game up and give our audience what they want because there are people willing to co uh, consume quality content. This uh, production quality doesn't always come with uh, budget. That's what I feel. Because uh, uh, getting a camera now nowadays, cameras are like you can shoot very good quality images with whatever camera you have. And adding into that and thinking about how this is going to look on screen and creating things, it doesn't always take a lot of money. We see a lot of people uh, adding videos onto YouTube and all. That. So I think we can compete, definitely compete with uh, Hollywood and Bollywood movies and we just need to find the right uh, people to invest and all that and we can make, create a very big industry here. For many who watched it, Teddy could be a different experience. But for Kasun and Akash, it will be just another prize in their collection of work. A collection they will continue to add on in their journey of telling stories. Sanita Sena Naika, News First. Colombo.